You don't have to wait until spring training to get a taste of baseball. The 36th annual Cubs convention starts today. I wanted you to keep singing. I know. I was <laughs> trying to trail off. My voice is not great. <laughs> it is a really big deal. Fans from all over the country and even a few from around the world travel here to Chicago to see their favorite current and former Cubs. CBS 2's Jackie Kostek live at the downtown Sheraton with an early preview. Jackie, so great to have the Cubs convention back. It was canceled the last two years because of COVID and the baseball lockout. Yeah, Ryan and Audrina, I can barely even hear what you said because that Go Cubs Go was just blasting in my ear, which I love. That's a good way to uh, pump up the music before uh, the Cubs convention kicks off in just under 12 hours. But I will say there are actually fans already camped out on the other side of where we are right now because they're, they want to be first in line for the meet and greets later on today, which is awesome, or this whole weekend. Here with Julian Green, uh, Senior Vice President of Communications for the Cubs. Good morning to you. Good morning. Happy Cubs convention. Happy Happy Cubs convention back for the first time in three years. How pumped up are you to just have this event back in person? Uh, we're just so excited about this for our fans. I mean, three years given COVID to bring everyone back together. This is our 36th annual, well not annual, but 30, 36th convention. Yes. And so there's so many Cubs fans, generations of Cubs fans, grandparents and great grandparents and the children that will be here this weekend. And so we're just excited to have everyone here at the Sheridan. The Cubs had such a great back half of last season. They've had a really active off season so far. So how much does that play into just how exciting this weekend is knowing that we're likely heading into a year that will be, uh, that we'll see a competitive Cubs team? A tremendous excitement. I mean, if you can think that adding Dansby Swanson yeah. and Cody Bellinger with the likes of Nico Horner and Ian Happ, uh, it's a lot to get excited about this Cubs team, especially the way this team played in the second half of the year, above 500, and we were probably one of the best teams in baseball at the end of the season as we ended the first, second half. Absolutely. Talk about some of the new things that Cubs fans can expect from this year's convention. I know we're going to be heading down to the archives room, archive rooms shortly. Uh, a lot to see down there. Sure. Well, it's been three years, and so there are some elements that fans will that they know and love, like the opening ceremony, uh, Dempster show tonight. Uh, we'll have bingo for our fans, but actually new is the Harry Karaoke. So oh, our fans gosh. are going to be excited. And so if you want to have, you want, if you want your traditional <laughs> Cubs commission experience, you got it. But there's some new elements that we're throwing. And then the autographs. You got to make sure you get your autograph this weekend. Oh, my gosh. Uh, Julian, are you going to be singing a song later on today? Uh, I won't be singing a song <laughs> later on, but I'll be in the wings, you know, probably judging with my <laughs> scorecard. And so fans should get ready. It's going to be a really fun night of music. I love it. Uh, you're going to want to stay tuned all morning long because we're going to have live interviews. Uh, we're going to meet Clark the Cub later on this morning and we're going to head down to those archive rooms because I actually already went down there. We see the 2016 World Series trophy, which just makes you want to touch it. Obviously, you can't touch it, but you can see it, which is awesome. Uh, Ryan and Audrey, a lot to see here. Back to you. All right, Jackie, it's going to be a busy morning. Great to have the Cubs convention back. Kind Definitely. Tied us over into the baseball season. And the 2023 Cubs convention runs today through Sunday at the Sheridan Grand Chicago in Streeterville. The opening ceremony tonight at 6. There are activities all day Saturday and from 9 to noon on Sunday. Now, there still are Friday only weekend passes and hotel packages available if you want to attend.